This is the all-new Hacker Jeopardy Safe Mode, brought to you by the very people who should know better. And now, for your virtual gaming pleasure, here is your host, Lintel. Hi, everybody. Welcome to the DEF CON New Year's Eve edition Super Tiebreaker Apocalypse Extraordinaire where we break the tie of Hacker Jeopardy from DEF CON in 2020 because if there's one thing we can't let happen it's going into a new year 2021 with statistical anomalies because we all know how, how this worked this past year. Uh, Everybody, thank you so much for uh, for watching tonight. Uh, we are all excited to be here to uh, provide you some championship action. Uh, we've you know we made some uh, difficult questions. We've got a whole lot of crazy for you. We've got two teams uh, that have uh, again dialed in from around the world to try to uh, entertain you uh, with not only their knowledge but also their skills in drinking. Uh, and without any further ado, a couple of quick shout outs. Thanks a lot to the DFIU TV team, Fizzgig, Wynn, Kaylee, and myself for, uh, you know, for bringing this all to you together today. And uh, without any further ado, uh, let's go to the big board and meet our teams. Let's play. Back in Jeopardy. Everybody. Welcome. Welcome to the end of the apocalypse. Uh, 2020 is almost over, and well, I don't have a lot of uh, faith for 2021, except for the fact that we're we're still here. Everything is still ostensibly okay, uh, but we got two teams uh, on on my on my left uh, with a uh, on my on my right. I don't know, whatever. On in blue, how about that? In blue, uh, we've got uh, three players who are very well familiar with playing Hacker Jeopardy having won a number of competitions at contests at conferences worldwide. Everybody, in blue, it's the Church of Wi-Fi. Church of Wi-Fi, everybody. Let's have a hand, yeah. Uh, Church of Wi-Fi today, from top to bottom, we've got Dr. Sexual Potato MD, Renderman, and our team captain, Eva Mog. Mog, how you doing? I'm doing fantastic. It's great to be here on New Year's Eve. Are you all? Uh, have you done a lot of preparation for the big, uh, the big match uh, today? You know, I've been practicing my liver for the last couple of weeks. We're all prepared, and uh, look forward to doing battle on the uh, game show here. Well, excellent. Well, we'll we'll find out a little bit more about uh, you and your team's New Year's resolu resolutions uh, between the two rounds. But without any further ado, I have to, uh, you know, kind of introduce the meme from Hacker Jeopardy. Uh, our team in red, they are, you know, they seem to be perennially in second place. This time they made it a tie. Who knows? Maybe even this time they'll win the game. It's show and tell net in red. Hey. And from <laughs> top to bottom, uh, we've got our captain, Jeff McJunkin, Sketch, and Logan. Hi, everybody. Jeff, how, how are you guys doing? Are you ready, uh, ready to play the game? If 2020 has prepared me for one thing, it is not Hacker Jeopardy, but my liver has been fully prepared by all of the 2020 events. So I'm uh, ready. The zombies are not yet at the door. So uh, let's do this before they arrive. Uh, is it? Yeah, I think that's great. Is this uh, finally your time you're going to take down Church of Wi-Fi? You know, we've been studying up on our well-known port numbers. So uh, we're pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> what port is Telnet on? It's in the teens somewhere, I'm pretty sure. 
That was legit. All right. All right. Well, if, if that is not the kind of inspiration that we need to get into round one, let's play Hacker Jeopardy. All right. Uh, let's populate that board. And your categories for round number one are Mask Up, Seconds, Wi-Fi, Fictional Computers, Solar Winds, <laughs> is it too soon? Rob. It's too soon, isn't it? Nah, yeah, fuck soon. it, we'll do it live. And finally, <laughs> pick the fake. Pick the fake. I'm going to give you a number of top-level domains. You tell me which one. Lintile made up. All right. Um, uh, uh, let's see. Um, I guess we'll, we'll spin the Wheel of Doom to figure out who goes first. Odd number, it's Church and Wi-Fi. Even number, it's Show and Telnet. Just like the port number for Telnet. And... It's 24, so show and tell net. You have control. That's the board. board number for tell net. Yes! <laughs> Woohoo, tell net. All right. Oh, my goodness. This meme will never die. Where are we nope. going, Jeff? Sketch, you Sketch your choice. Uh, fictional computers for 100. Fictional computers for 100. Here we go. The evil villain in the world of Tron. Show and tell net. What is MCP? Uh, can you expand it for me? What is the master control program? That's the correct response. Well done. Woo! Woo! All right. It's, uh, still in control, Telnet. Fictional computers for 200. This waterproof supercomputer, married to Sheldon Plankton on SpongeBob, may want to talk to a manager. Church of Wi-Fi. What is Karen? What is Karen is the correct <laughs> response. Karen Plankton. Absolutely right. Big SpongeBob fan there, Render? Yeah, I had a feeling. All right, Church of Wi-Fi, you're in the lead and in control. Dictional computers for 300. The computer on the NCC 1701D was referred to by this five letter acronym. Church of Wi Fi? What is, what is L C A R S? Yeah, L in stereo and correct. L cars, absolutely right. Well done. All right, a uh, little bit of a lead for Church of Wi Fi. You're still in control. For four. The computer that finally came up with the answer, 42. Show and tell net. What is deep thought? What is deep thought is correct. Well done. All tied up. Tell net, you're in control. <laughs> Let's just go for five. Cleaning out the category for five. The Human Brain Scan Become AI TV Personality, portrayed by Matt Frewer. Show and tell net. What is Max Headroom? What is Max Headroom is correct for a thousand oh, yeah. points and the lead. Hey, everybody. Win Schwartow's here. Let's hear it for Win Schwartow. Yeah, Win! Oh, I'm so overwhelmed. I just want to say. Happy I know, New you're Year. probably. What? I'm probably. Oh, no, what? go ahead. No, that's all right. I'm probably what? I wanted you to take the first shot. I was saying to the audience that you're probably surprised that Wynn connected his computer all the way to the Zoom meeting so that it sounded good, right? I wanted to thank all you guys. I mean, it is, for many of you, this has been like, tw how many, 25 years? Thank you for continuing the tradition and going safe and doing all that. I humbly bow in all of your directions. Carry on the tradition. Thank you, enjoy, and I'm just going to sit here and enjoy myself. Thanks, man. Gross. Video off while you enjoy I mean, thanks, Damn it. <laughs> well, 
Yeah, it's not Hacker Jeopardy unless Wynn enjoys himself. But anyways, let's get back to the board. Show and tell, Matt, you are in control. Uh, you're going to have to pick a new category. Let's go with Solar Winds for 100. Solar Winds for 100. Let's see if everybody has been reading the internet. One of the founders of Solar Winds, Donald Yance, was a former executive at this evil blue retail corporation. Show and tell, Matt. What is IBM? What is IBM is incorrect. Church of Wi-Fi, would you like to attempt? Nah. Hearing nobody. Uh, no, uh, IBM is not a retail corporation. Uh, the correct response is, uh, what is Walmart? Walmart. Yeah. All right. Uh, that little bit of a setback there, Telnet, but you're still in control. Uh, Solar Winds for 200. Solar Winds for two. Solar Winds produced a version of this common networking tool where each hop is identified between a source and a target. Show and tell net. What is Trace Route? Better known as Tracer T. Tracer T or Trace Route is the correct response. Well done. 300. Solar winds for three. There are currently investigations into this suspected illegal activity at Solar Winds, as almost two hundred and eighty million dollars of stock was sold off only days prior to the breach announcement. Show and tell net. What is what insider, is insider trading? trading? What is insider trading is the correct response. Well done. Uh, pulling out to a little bit of a lead. Four hundred. By now, everyone has heard of Sunburst, but Microsoft found a second attack. They dubbed this even more explosive astronomical term. Show and tell net. What is Solorigate? Uh, no, I'm sorry, that's incorrect. Church of Wi-Fi, would you like to attempt? Nah. Seeing, seeing shaking heads. Uh, the, what I was going here is uh, supernova. 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 Yeah, uh, I, you know, it's like all, all, you know, just as good as Sunburst, but less code signing. Anyways, uh, back to the board. Uh, one last cat, a clue in that category, or we can go somewhere else. Let's close it out like twenty twenty. Yeah, yeah. Put Solar Winds to bed. That's uh, that's a big agreement there. <laughs> Oh my goodness! Looks like uh, we have uh, just uh, reached our uh, first DFIU double. So I would say, in the spirit of "Don't fuck it up," show and tell that how much you're going to wager on this category in the category Solar Winds. Bet it all. Bet it all. Do it. I will take wind advice in many things, but especially today. Let's go for it. You're going to bet it all. All right, locking in. All right, here, points. here, 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 here. All right, here is your clue. Solar Winds had a production FTP server which could be accessed for upload with this hilariously simple password. I know what this is. <laughs> is case matter? I mean, yes. What? Anybody else got it? I what mean, I know. Solar wind one two three exclamation point. Oh my goodness, the punctuation got you in the end, Jeff. No, it's just solar uh. winds one two three. Oh, I'm so sorry, uh, but that's gonna be all of it. Uh, yeah, ignore the fact that this is uh, uppercase, but yes, it is the actual correct response is uh, lowercase solar winds one two three. Well, uh, you know, it was a it was a good gamble to take. Yeah. Sorry about that, but uh, you know what? It's it's very early in round one. We're going to have two rounds today, so uh, where are we going next? Uh, let's steal from our fellow church members. I hear that's good to steal from clergy and go to Wi-Fi. One. All right, Wi-Fi for how much? 100? Here's your clue. According to an advertising slogan for the Wi-Fi Alliance, it's the, quote, standard for wireless this. 
show and tell net. What is security? No. Church of Wi Fi? I see. I see the. I see the. The mostly Canadian team has gone with drinking as a strategy. <laughs> this might not be the best. Or the might not be oh, the worst strategy. Got me. All right. Uh, no, I'm sorry. The uh, the the correct answer. The Fi in Wi-Fi, although it's not official, according to one fidelity. advertising slogan, it was fidelity. Fidelity. Wireless fidelity. Mm. I figured they wouldn't right. advertise now, that. Now it's time point. to get. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, high fidelity win. Am I right? <laughs> High fidelity, we we called that stereo. It was an analog function, but that's a different discussion. <laughs> wind is up into his more potatoes. When they're banging rocks together, the wind. Sorry. Is that what was happening was when they were banging rocks potato. together in the caveman days? <laughs> that, another discussion. Another discussion. Q and A comes up later. The answer was yes. <laughs> Please, please, Jeff, pick another category. <laughs> Second for one. The crack, the crack okay, attack sure. on WPA2 relied on inducing reuse of these throwaway values in cryptographic operations. Church of Wi-Fi. What is a NAR initialization vectors? Okay, mm -hmm. you're lucky here because uh, Mog's... I've got to take your first response, and very clearly the first response that I heard was nonce from from uh, from Mog, and so we're going to give you the correct response, even though initialization vectors was afterwards and wrong. So that was correct. <clears throat> My goodness. It's technically the same thing, but direct attacks with IVs were first. Anyway, very cool. Okay, number one, they are not technically the same thing. Stop that right now, because uh, no. But anyways, moving on. You got lucky because Mog's internet's slightly faster than yours. Moving back to the board. Three hundred. There's Wi-Fi. I'm used to it, but you're in control. Three hundred. Set for three. <laughs> nice. Three hundred. <laughs> the official logo of the Wi-Fi Alliance is based on this symbol from ancient Chinese philosophy. Anybody? Whoever's Googling, stop it. Is that win? win I said sorry Googling. for the one day. Like the loss. <laughs> All right. Uh, anybody? Last chance. Three, two, one. We're looking for the yin yang. The yin yang. You'll look it up later. You'll figure it out. You've seen this everywhere. Uh, All right. Church of Wi-Fi, you're in the lead. My high school girlfriend are in the control. Four hundred for four. The expansion of SSID. Church of Wi-Fi. What is service set identifier? What is service set identifier is the correct response. Absolutely well done. We can do more than drink. All right, back to the board. Uh, pulling out with a lot of $100 lead Speak here. Speak for yourself. <laughs> Wi-Fi for five. We're going for five. War driving is the process of tracking down and identifying signals like Wi-Fi, but this is going further to make literal graffiti where signals are found. Church of Wi-Fi. What is war chalking? What is war chalking is the correct response. In the lead by 1700. Show and tell that you're going to need to uh, pick things up a little bit here to stay close in round number one, but uh, Church of Wi Fi, you're in control. We're going mask up for one. Mask up for one. A balaclava. Show and tell that. What is a mask? Uh, be more specific. What is a face mask? Be more specific. What is it? Face. What is a Middle Eastern, Eastern face mask? Uh, no, I'm gonna say no to that. Church of Wi-Fi. What is a uh, ski mask? Church of Wi-Fi. 
What is a ski mask? Is the that's it? Render response is what I'm going for. <laughs> yep, absolutely right. All right. Uh, apparently, they know how to use masks in Canada. Who knew? All right. Uh, <laughs> We're going masks for two. In decimal, the subnet mask of a slash sixteen network. Show and tell net. What is 255.255.0.0? Is the correct response. Well done. You're out of the hole. Hooray! Yay! For now. That's the, that's the edge of the hole. A fresh start. Zero is a start. hole. All right. Uh, Telnet, you're back in control. Mask uh, up for 300. Universe is right. A bitmap, which is used to indicate the areas of a digital picture display with or without transparency. Show and tell net. What is a bit mask? Um, I'm going to accept it because Win Schwerto actually uh, convinced me before the show that that was an acceptable answer as well. Uh, what I was going for was image mask, but I will accept a bit mask as well. That is the correct response. All Before. right, show and tell net, you're still in control. Here we go. In Octal, the parameter to you mask to get 0644 as initial file permissions. Show and tell net. What is 7133? Uh, I will accept 7133 is correct. Uh, I just realized that that's the right response is set up for what I read. But yes, uh, I, will, I, will, I will have my own drink. Sometimes when somebody figures it out and you realize that they had the right answer, it's it's fine. Hey, I've, just, I've literally what just been by myself in this room for... Yeah. Well, uh, that'll be one on my tab for the next time we're all back together in 2021 right. or 2028 or whenever that happens again. All right, show and tell Matt, you're in the lead. Mask up for 500. Mask up for five. The rights to this mask are hilariously owned by Time Warner, giving them royalties every time one is bought in protest. Church of Wi-Fi. What is the guy? What Fox? is the guy? guy Fox Fox mask? <laughs> Three times, it's uh, it's right every single one. What is the guy Fox mask is the correct response? I get, Doesn't does it make I get you feel good at all you... No, no, no sorry. Uh, that race condition has been solved by my firmware. But uh, it, it's good to know that every time one of you uh, morons watching this buys one of those to do something stupid, you're paying Time Warner. Congratulations. All right, two categories to go. Church of Wi-Fi, you're 1,500 ahead in the lead. Where are we going next? Not with my Time uh, Warner branded 3D printer. <laughs> Let's go with the, uh, what the hell? I can't read either of those. Um, pick the fake for 100. <clears throat> pick the fake for 100. Uh, remember, these are all top level domains, one of which I've made up. Tell me which one's the fake. Dot Boston, dot NYC, or dot Toronto? Show and tell net. What is dot Toronto? Well, that's the correct response. The other two are real. Figured I'd throw some Canadian love out there, but uh, I guess that's a Canadian fail. Canadian fail. Nobody likes the Canadians. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Like Toronto anyways. Right, it's okay. We didn't, we didn't have the opportunity to fix every feature, but we made sure that that one was working. I'm just letting you know I that. Appreciate that. Right. Nobody likes so Toronto. much dev time for a throwaway joke. <laughs> yeah, I didn't get all the answers right on the screen, but damn it if we didn't have a little thing that says Canadian fail, right, Dave? Canadian fail! <laughs> oh, man, that's good. That balances the scales a bit. Uh, yeah. Yep, 200. good enough. Showed you. All right, where are we going next, Telnet? 200 pick. 200. Dot pizza, dot cheese, dot beer, or dot delivery? Makes me hungry. Church of Wi Fi. Dot cheese. What is dot cheese? Not in the form of the question. question. Uh, show and Telnet. Render, you fucked it up. 
What is dot cheese? What is dot cheese is the right response. What is dot cheese in our way to victory? All right. What All is right, so 50, 50. Bless you too, Mom. All right, show and tell that. Where are we going? I'm pretty sure that's a church of Wi-Fi blessing. It is. It's, 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 it's and also with you. If it's not, it should be. I heard pick the fake to 300. <laughs> and it's a DFI you double. Don't fuck it up. Show and tell that you are literally half of what Church of Wi-Fi has as a total. It's also the same you situation. Bet it all again. All right. Bet it, it all. all. Bet it all. Are you going to bet it, it all? Do it all. It's the only all right. option. All right. Let's go for it. Win said you. Wynn would never hear me wrong again. Win made me By the it. way, for the purposes of... Uh, I wasn't the one wrong. Must, uh, for the purposes of the lawyers, I have to tell you that uh, we at Hacker Jeopardy do not endorse following Wynn Schwartow's opinion. Actually, <laughs> all 1,000... Right uh, uh, for a share of the lead, dot .intel, dot .amd, dot .dell, or dot .ibm. Uh, I would speculate the second one because they don't seem like as big of a dicks. What is <laughs> dot .amd? What is dot .amd? Is the correct response. And we've got a tie. Yeah! 2,000. I'm, I'm, I'm getting tired of this tie stuff. We're going to run out of questions. All right, back to the board. <laughs> Tell Nat you're in control. Uh, Pick the fake for category. four. Uh, what seconds for what? Go seconds for one. Seconds for one. Okay, seconds for one. An injected second of this type is represented as 2359.60 in many operating systems. Church of Wi Fi? What, what is, is a, leap, a second? leap second? What is a leap second? I heard it in stereo, and that is correct. <laughs> Head by 100 points. You've got the board. Seconds for two. Seconds for two. 72 hectoseconds in hours. Metric again. It's a metric prefix. Da -da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. Show and tell that. What is two? What is two hours is the correct response. A hectosecond being very clearly 100 seconds for everybody who doesn't do the metric system here. Telnet, you are in the lead, or in, in the control. 300. The length of a second is based off of the frequency of an isotope of this element, symbol CS. Church of Wi-Fi? What is cesium? What is cesium, cesium Adam? What is cesium is correct. You really well got to do back into the lead. And I think you missed all cesium. Right. We're in the future uh, here well, with one stereo. Was, We're going for four. One was the, uh, ah, okay. You'll need to bring a second for support if you wish to challenge someone to this one-on-one -on -one combat. What is a Show duel? Show and tell net. What is a duel is the correct response. Somebody saw Hamilton. All right, uh, tell it you're in control. Three clues left in round one. Uh, seconds for five. Seconds for 500. Declaration of a second is necessary for a motion to be considered by a parliament according to this 1876 book of guidelines. Church of the Book of Wi Fi. Book of the Church of Wi Fi. Church what of is Wi-Fi. Robert's Rules of Order? Is the correct response. Sticking you back in the lead. Head by 300. Well done. Oh, Canada and your parliament. <laughs> I mean, how many of us are calling I mean, rules? We have a proper you right society, that. unlike you heathens. <laughs> Wait, your parliament, like, passes stuff? Yeah, we actually and do not shit. Just, yeah. We're going for four. <laughs> All right, pick the fake for four. 
dot tar dot zip dot cab or dot data. Show and tell net. What, what is, is dot tab? Data? What is dot cab is incorrect. Church of Wi-Fi. What is dot data? That data is also incorrect. Uh, fair play, that? everybody oh. lost the same. It's dot that's tar. It. So dot no zip. Oh. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Dot 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 zip is uh, a Google domain. Dot cab is actually made for taxis. Dot data is a data science thing. Anyways, dot tar is my goodness. All right, last clue. Dot red. Dot blue. Dot green. Or dot yellow. <laughs> Fuck if I know. All right, no takers. Going once. Going twice. Give it to Dave. Gone. <sighs> Sorry, everybody. The correct response here is dot yellow. Dot yellow. You couldn't even put an RGB in with the right that? I know, right? Annoying, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, uh, we've reached the end of round one. Uh, let's, uh, let's take a couple of uh, seconds and talk to our teams. So, uh, you know, Dr. Sexual Potato, is it sensual potato or sexual potato? Or does it does it change over time? I accept either. It changes. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's, what is it it's right now? Works. Right now, it's Dr. Sensual Potato. Feeling more sensual. It turns out sensual and sexual are actually both uh, a title and not his first name. And he has earned both titles, so either works. This is a super fun fact coming from the other team. I like I like the energy we're creating in this yeah. room. I mean, the uh, so we'll say, uh, any, we hear about making cannon. Micronation of Sealand. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so, so have have you made any uh, New Year's resolutions? Uh, I oddly enough to stop drinking so much. <laughs> so, <laughs> well. The, this is but a I'll, real strange way to start that. Oh, wait, I guess you don't have to do that for another couple hours. That's a really good point. Yeah, exactly. I'm getting my last blows in. Yeah, well, <laughs> welcome, uh, welcome, welcome. Thanks for being here today. Uh, un un under the sexual potato, it's Renderman. Renderman, thanks for, thanks for being here today. Uh, how, how's your 2020 been? Uh, well, I think this little guy uh, exemplifies it, you know. Kind of a dumpster fire, but uh, you know, getting through. Yeah, still here. Good. And anything you're particularly looking forward to in the new year? Smiting all my enemies. Mm. That's a hearing that's the a, a worthy the goal, I'd say. Well, I'm already drinking from well, skulls, uh, so you know. This is a, this is a fact. Well, thanks for being here, Render. And the last member, last but not least, the Church of Wi-Fi. Evil Mog, Evil Mog, how you doing, my man? Oh, I've been doing good. I mean, this is what my third event this New Year's I've been participating in because I've got who slide is it anyways and the whole DefCon mud going on. So, I mean, what can I say? I'm a dirty little slut that hits everything. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you didn't need to prove you didn't need to prove to this crowd that you're a scene whore. We understand. Uh, have you um, have have you you know? Do you have any strange like or fun? Uh, food traditions around the holidays or like New Year's? Do you eat something special or anything like that up in Canada? Yeah, we do actually. So I order brisket off my local barbecue place, get as much beer delivered as I can. That's arriving here shortly. Other than that, I don't really do much. I'm kind of boring. Yeah, who would have guessed that the Canadian holiday tradition would be more drinking? Well, anyways, without any further uh, <laughs> without any further ado, everybody, let's have a hand for one of our champions coming into today, Church of Wi-Fi. <laughs> and on the right hand side, uh, or my right, somebody's right, uh, we've got the red team uh, show and tell net, uh, starting off with the captain Jeff McJunkin. Jeff, you got a sweet background set up there. It looks like. Uh, you know, you've been, have you just been in that room ever since DEF CON? Correct. I actually uh, haven't left here for a, a few months now. Been in lockdown. So uh, looking forward to 2021 where I get to leave this room. Uh, the other uh, corner just saw a screen. Right now you really, really don't want to leave. 
What, He's what, just been squatting in open mic night stage. That's my bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you see. Good. Good. And and when will the improv reopen? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's good. Yes, and, uh, well, I... Jeff. Yeah, th thank you. Somebody knows improv. That's perfect. Yes, and? You know, uh, all you right. know Thanks I have a there, friend Jeff. who does improv. I asked him if he had a favorite word, and he said, yes, and. <laughs> yeah. Spectacular. Ah. Well, if that wasn't a cry you know, for help, I don't know what it is. I'm not sure where it came from, well, but um, <laughs> Death Row 27 seems likely. Oh, well, that's, that's good. Uh, no, uh, below, below Jeff, we've help. got Sketch. Oh, that's fair. That Yeah, that mango... <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Whatever gluten-free concoction that is. Uh, Sketch, you've got a pretty interesting uh, jacket on there. What do you got there? Yeah, um, you know, I felt like it was a formal occasion that I need to get dressed up for to celebrate the end of this horrible, horrible year. Uh, I couldn't yeah. find... I think they call them leg shirts. There used to be a name for them. I forget. I think they're called... Uh, so them. I figured... Yeah. yeah. Can't no, that doesn't sound right. <laughs> Can't be it. Um, so I, I, I went with a jacket. Uh, torso pants. Got it. Well, Sketch, yes. thanks for being here today. I uh, hope you enjoy your New Year's uh, with the rest of us here. Last but not least, uh, the, the, the man, the myth, the legend, it's Logan. How's it going, man? Is Logan, enjoying my beer? What, what? Having a good time? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, when, uh, what, what, what do you, what is your resolution for next year? Will you want to share that with the the class? Sure. You know, I would like to try to win Hacker Jeopardy. That'd be, that'd be my goal, my resolution. Nobody wins Hacker that's Jeopardy. Harder. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's harder. That's works. gonna. Well, I, I don't want to, I, I don't want to like put that off for you next year. But Logan, uh, I hate to tell you that this competition is barely going to finish. Uh, before midnight, so technically your New Year's resolution is for winning next year. So let's oh. make that very clear. You're gonna have Good to come to back, and you're gonna have to win. Uh, and and just so everybody realizes, uh, you know, as we get to the second half of this game, uh, both these teams were tied in first place at the end of Hacker Jeopardy at DefCon, and so the winner of this game uh, is going to be uh, functioning as the uh, the incoming champion. Uh, but when we, uh, you know, go back to uh, the normal bracket at DEF CON next year, uh, the second place team uh, will still automatically be qualified uh, and will play on day one, but will need to requalify for the finals uh, by virtue of losing this round. Uh, so a lot on the line here in round two. Uh, what do you think, uh, everybody? Are we ready to go for it? <laughs> or not? <laughs> oh, oh hell yeah! Someone send an emergency beer delivery. <laughs> <laughs> He's literally snowed in right now. Canada's out of beer. Oh. Canada's most plentiful yeah, no, natural resource: like... snow. <laughs> You'll notice that the uh, the point values are all doubled up here on the scoreboard, so the maximum value of the clue is a thousand. And these six garbage categories came from my brain to yours. Here they come. Oh. Heteronyms. Uh, for it? those of you that don't know what a heteronym is, it's uh, two words which are spelled the same but pronounced and mean different things. Two words which are spelled the same, so each answer is going to be two words. Um, how it's made, which is uh, I'm going to give you a text editor. You tell me the language it's programmed in. Oh, yeah. All about sauce. Crypto means cryptocurrency. Fuck you. Yes. Movies by character. Telnet plus or minus one. Okay, so in each of these answers, uh, you're going to see a number which may be the port number for Telnet. Or it might be Telnet plus one or Telnet minus one. So, so it's still on the team. If I... Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, you got it, Jeff. That's that's the, yeah, that's yeah. the spirit. The, the, Problem solved. The, 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 so the, so the, the thing is, is if you were trying to say, I don't know, uh, whatever number, instead of that, so if there was like a book title or a show or anything that had that number in it, 
you're going to need to replace that with the word Telnet, if it's that number, Telnet plus one or Telnet minus one, depending on like what the correct answer is. Does that make sense? So you're not yeah, going to say, like, oh, yeah, this is going to be really great. I had this idea last night. I'm going to love it. You might not. I'm going to. Anyways, and finally. I was told there would be no math. <laughs> this year or last year? I'm just very simply going to tell you a thing that happened, and you have to tell me whether it happened this year, 2020, or last year, 2019. Because time passes, oh, and everything sucks. All right, show and tell that by virtue of being in second place, you are in control of the board. Woo! Sketch. I mean, it's got our name on it. Let's go for Telnet plus or minus one. For how much? For 200. A no-win situation or a Joseph Heller novel. Show and tell that. What is Catch-22? Incorrect. Should have listened, should, should have listened to my description. Church of Wi-Fi. What is Telnet what is minus telnet one? Telnet plus one. No. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, no, that's incorrect. Uh, uh, that, it's fine. Everything's fine. Uh, I, I kind of expected this to happen, uh, but the correct answer I was looking for is what is catch twelve Telnet minus one. Everybody go. Oh, oh. oh. got it. Oh. All right. What is I just came here to have a good time, and I'm feeling very attacked right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. that's fair. Destruction uh, right, All right, I'm so excited. Um, all right, so uh, <laughs> would you like to try that again, Sketch? Yes, let's do. Uh, <laughs> Telnet plus or minus one for 400. Plus you too. All right, Telnet plus or minus one for 400. To the nearest degree... The tilt of the Earth's axis. <laughs> oh, right off. <laughs> Show and tell, Matt. What is Telnet minus one degrees? <laughs> no, I'm sorry, that's incorrect. Touching Wi Fi. Not touching this one with a 200 foot pole. <laughs> <laughs> Not in the form of a question. Oh. All right, somebody run in, Church of Wi-Fi. What is Telnet degrees? What is Telnet degrees is absolutely right. 23. 23.4. <laughs> All right, well done, potato. 22. 22. <laughs> yeah, not, good try, though, Jeff. Uh, <laughs> All right, uh, potato, you're in control. Yeah, let's do, uh, let's do Telnet plus or minus one for 600. All right, here we go. The number of bits necessary to render a pixel in true color. Church of Wi-Fi. What is Telnet plus one bits? What is Telnet plus one bits is absolutely right. Well done. Uh, let's Church do Telnet plus or minus control. one for 800. For 800. DFIU double! Don't fuck it up! All right, Church of Wi-Fi, uh, you're in the lead by uh, 1,700. Uh, how much would you like to wager? The entire Canadian GNP. Yeah, so 500. <laughs> Wait, do you want to do 1,000 or 500? Oh, Telnet dollars. Oh, that's a good one. Let's do Telnet dollars. Mog, what do you think? <laughs> I mean, you've 500. at least got to do tell. You got to at least do a hundred Telnet dollars. Come on. You know. All right, fine. All we'll right. Do a uh, thousand. You said a thousand. Okay. One zero zero zero. We have one thousand. Is it? And your clue. Jim Carrey starred in this creepy film about numerology. What is the number Telnet? What is the number Telnet is absolutely right. Well done. Damn. All right, Church of Wi-Fi, you're well, like still in control. Terrible movie, by For those way. of us in the audience, so what is the movie title again? 
<laughs> the number 23. Yeah. It was awful. It was awful. It's 23? Fuck. Wait. There, there is what are you doing, actually man? a movie. Like, I, I, you like, know, I was going to give man? a factoid, but I don't know if this is Telnet plus or minus one number 1,000, which should be our next one, just in case. Okay, yeah, let's wait until we're out of the category before you factoid. Thank you for being cognizant right. of that. All right. I, yeah, let's well, I don't want to give the other guys a... You know. Julius Caesar was stabbed this many times in 44 BC. Spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> Going for it. Show and tell that. What is telling that minus one times? Oh no, I'm sorry, that's incorrect. Church of Wi Fi. <laughs> this is the best category I've ever written. All right, Church of Wi Fi, you gonna beautiful. go for it? <laughs> nope. Yeah, I didn't think so. Uh, no, what is telling it? When in doubt, yeah. that's <laughs> telling it. <laughs> All right, well, um, Excuse I me again. myself. Boy, I oh, myself, so let's work on entertaining yes. everybody else. Church of Wi Fi, you're well in control. That's not a lint I'll fail. I'm correct. Yet. Oh, God, that was gross. We're let's going cut for that crypto out. Crypto means <laughs> cryptocurrency for 200. All right, crypto means cryptocurrency for 200. A meme about the strategy of hoarding digital currency, waiting for appreciation and value, features this misspelled four-letter word. Show and tell net. What, what is, is HODL? What is HODL? HODL gang, HODL gang, HODL gang is the correct it's response. <laughs> All right, where are we going next? Straight to hell, probably. So. Four, 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 Jeff? Is that what you meant? Two. Two hundred. Yeah, you just did that one. You <laughs> already did two hundred. Sorry, the Will second category. Okay. Four hundred, please. Yeah. Oh, Here's there you go. Satoshi, Satoshi mined this beginning block in the Bitcoin blockchain with a reward of 50 Bitcoin. Show and tell net. What is the Genesis block? Is the correct response. Well done. Coming back. What is the third in the category? $600. The financial incentive for nodes on the blockchain to mine individual transactions, usually paid by the transaction broadcaster. Five, four, three. Show and tell net. What is the transaction fee? I'm going to need you to be more specific there. What is the transaction fee paid to the miners? Mining fee. <laughs> yes, that's what that that is what the clue is trying to get you to tell me what it is. And I'm sorry, I can't accept that. Church of Wi-Fi, would you like to give it a shot? Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry. What I was looking for here was what is gas? What is gas? gas. Oh, I knew Pay the like gas that. to. Oh, well, that's specific. But... All right. Move it's away. Specific to it. Move known... away. All right. Move away. All right. I guess we're going to the next one. The smallest unit of no. Ethereum, ten to the negative eighteenth of a coin. No? Metric. Show and tell, Matt. Hashtag YOLO, what is a Satoshi? What is a Satoshi it would be the Bitcoin version. That's incorrect. Church of Wi-Fi? Sorry, had to try. No answer. It's away. <laughs> Okay. Apparently. The only Are we going to get rid of this category? Zoology. Fuck this, this category. This year or last year. This year or last year. Dear God. All right, cool. Since an ERC-20 token can be exchanged for other tokens of the same type without any change in value, it's considered this eight-letter F word. 
It's like, I, like you can take $100 and I give you $100 and it's the same amount. I mean, it's... Yeah. <laughs> yeah okay. I'm all fucked up. <laughs> you had this one ready. Yeah. That's only six. All right, well, uh, the, the word we're going fungible. here was fungible. It's a fungible. You're fungible. It's almost like somebody yeah, took a curse yeah. after about a death coin, and we destroyed that one, so. All right, well, well, Dave, I owe you five dollars <laughs> because <laughs> that was too hard. All right, how much is that? Sell that. You're in control. <laughs> this year or last year for two hundred. This year or last year for two hundred, West Virginia becomes the last U.S. state to have a confirmed case of 2019 COVID. Show and tell net. What is this year? What is this year is the correct response. It happened on March 17th. Out I think of the that's hole. the first case of West Virginia not having a disease. Yay! <laughs> this year or last year for 400. Twitter bans all political advertising worldwide. Show and tell net. What is this year? What is this year is incorrect. Church of Wi-Fi. Luckily, there's a lot of options remaining. What is last year? <laughs> what is last year is the correct response. <laughs> Wi-Fi, you're in control. We're go going for six. Elon Musk's and a bunch of other notable Twitter accounts hacked in a Bitcoin scam. Show and tell net. What is this year? What is this year's the correct response? It happened in July, which was like 14 years ago. Uh, that was beautiful. All right. Out of the hole again. Show and tell net. You're in control. Let's aim back for that hole. Go for 800. <laughs> Twitter Mr. issues Elon. first misleading label to Trump tweet. What is Church this year? of Wi-Fi. What is what this, is this year, year is the right response. It happened in May. Way too well late. Well done. <laughs> yeah, because that's definitely the first one which deserved it. I promise. <laughs> Going for one thousand. <laughs> oh, good. Frozen two released in the United States. more. What is last year? <laughs> last year. What, what is last year is the right response. November of last year, in fact. All Somebody right. has a daughter. All right, getting. <laughs> there we go. On yeah. behalf of the Church of Wi-Fi, I'd like Some... to welcome you out of the hole. <laughs> <laughs> Glad to be here. That is uh, not the first in. time I've heard that. <laughs> not, not, yeah. That's not the first time I've heard That's it. what they said. There we go. All right. Tell that you're in control. Uh, movies by character for two. Movies by character for two. Eugene Belford and Hal. <laughs> Show and tell net. What is 2001 A Space Odyssey? Incorrect. Church of Wi Fi. What is hackers? It's what the is other hackers team. is the correct response. Eugene <clears throat> Belford being Mr. The Plague, sir, and Hal being his Pendulet assistant. Uh, all right. Mm -hmm. Church of Wi Fi, you're in control. 400. Nerve CEO Gary Winston. Is that a real person or a TV person? No, in the movie. Second of the movie. Oh, one sec. It's uh. Five, four. Oh, Church of Wi-Fi. What is antitrust? What is antitrust? Is the correct response. That's right, because that Rachel Lee Cook away. I had to I'm glad I didn't go with the net. All right, where are we going next? Six. Six hundred. General Jack Berenger and Dr. John McKittrick. Show and tell net. What is War Games? What is War Games is the correct response. Well done. I asked for a 16, but I got a 61 in terms of the scores. All right, uh, where are we going next? 
800. Oh my goodness, it's a DFIU double. Don't fuck it up. All right, you've got 1600. You can wager all or any of that 1600 on movie movies by character. I mean, it's worked out I mean, well for us. It all has Lynn worked out about 50 percent of the time. Lynn, what do you think? Passing grade. Would you have it any other way? Do you have any other way out of this? Also, no. Thank you, Lynn. 1600, please. <laughs> <laughs> we believe in binary. All right, locked in. Locked in for 1600. Angela Bennett and Dr. Alan Champion. I got nothing. What is the net? What is the net is absolutely right. Well done. Pull it yeah. out. Well done. All right. Climb it. it was my guess for the 400 point question. Uh, <laughs> it was, in fact. It was down to show up. <laughs> Movies my character right. for a thousand. All right. Doctors Haywood Floyd and David Bowman. Fuck, I should know this. Doctors. Doctor. Yeah, you doctors. Doctor. 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 It is, in fact. <laughs> Five, four, three, two. Doctor Sexual. One. <laughs> what we're looking in for is. <laughs> What is 2001 oh. Space Odyssey? <laughs> Fuck! I mean... Oh, darn. So I can guess darn. the wrong answer to the right question? What is the net? Yeah, it's... <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm, just, I'm just glad that me sitting in a room by myself for eight months hasn't lost, made me lose it completely. All right, we got two <laughs> yeah. categories left. Show and tell net, you're in the lead. Or you're uh, in the amateur 200. Remember, two I need two two words. Two words is a response, but they're spelled the same. To connect a device to Bluetooth again or fix it. Church of Wi Fi? What are what are what repair, is repair and, and repair? repair? That is the correct response. What are repair and repair? Okay. <laughs> Where's next? It. 400. A unit of angular measure or something of small importance. Show and tell net? What are degree and degree? Nope. I'm sorry. That's incorrect. Church of Wi-Fi. Do you want to give it a shot? You really... You really dunking on my education here aren't you jeff <laughs> constantly with love. my degree that i pretend to have is of great importance to me i'll have you know sir <laughs> my bullshit phd is legitimate i tell you wait a minute hold on i've got to judge hey win something yeah. of small importance as a degree would you accept that as a response yeah well, you know, I'm glad you asked that because uh, I don't know if you heard me grunt and make noises, but he said degree and degree, and it was like, damn, that was a good potential alternate answer, and I had already thought of that. And uh, in well, consideration, I mean, are you gonna give I'm, I'm going to give it to him. All right. Oh. All right that, was a, uh, oh. that was a $400 clue, so I will... Uh, I will adjust the score plus 800 because they are at 32. And so we will make it 3,600. I'll give you more for the math involved. Thank you. Do you concur with that? So we took away the wrong answer and gave them results for a correct answer. 400. Can we just All call right, it a crappy keeper. question? No! No, the, no, it may have been a crappy answer. But the not. question was there good. Go. Okay, let's go, Drake. We're good. You can totally totally it, it doesn't. It doesn't change the who the host and judge of this game show are. That's fine. <laughs> All right. 
All right, so show and tell net, you're going to stay in control of the board. Header on image for six. To update your ECDSA or to quit your job. Church of Wi-Fi. What is re-sign and resign? That is correct. Well so resign and Let resign. Good that was a good question. Let it be known that's the first time I've said that. That is a good question. <laughs> thank, thank you, Jeff. Your your approval means so much to me. Church of Wi-Fi is in control of the board, however. Where would you like to go next? <laughs> I like heteronyms. Let's Eight. go 800. Exactly correct, and the process to make it that way. Church of Wi-Fi. What are perfect and perfect? That's correct as well. Well done. Heteronyms for 1,000. An instance of an abstract data type and what many people do to this programming ideal. Church of Wi-Fi. What are object and object? That is also oh, that's correct. Good. Well done. Well done. Excellent job running the rest of that category. Good uh, job, commanding John. Commanding lead for Church of oh, wow. Wi-Fi. One, uh, one category for 200. left. VI, remember, I need the programming language when it's written in. Show and tell net. What is C? Correct. Well done. For 400. Emacs. Fire and garbage? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not touching that just because it's Emacs. Show and tell net. So the category is what primary language is this answer valid in? And therefore I will say bash. What is bash? Uh, no, the, oh. I want to be very clear. I want to be very clear. The, the category that I, is, that I said is what programming language is the program written in? That said, would you like to guess? C plus plus. No, I'm sorry, that's incorrect. Church of Wi-Fi. <laughs> Not touching that one. It's Richard Stallman. It's terrible. Emacs is pretty famously written in Lisp. Mm. Oof. Yeah, Oof. that's the right response. I mean, that's the right reaction at least. <laughs> what is irrelevant? <laughs> don't control don't start, shift alt don't start stuff that. like that on hacker jeopardy man there are a lot of people that like lisp see there's one of them over there that guy there's all one of them right there all right, <laughs> all right. nano oh i like nano <laughs> oh oh if you can get past your disgust to come out with what programming language it was written in not an official answer but probably logo <laughs> <laughs> show and tell that i'm sorry if i'm wrong but what is c is the correct response well done today i learned it'll eventually be right uh, descended from pico what is 23 show and tell that uh, <laughs> right. 800 <laughs> Notepad plus plus. Show and tell net. Takers. What is C plus plus? It's the right response. Good job. <laughs> and finally, JetBrains Pie Charm. Two languages. Ugh. Show and tell net. What is Jet and Python? Oh man, I'm gonna have to. 
I don't think That's Jet's positive. a language. <laughs> it's a database tactic technique. It's the uh, yeah, radical I... extensible table shit. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm I'm sorry. This 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 is terrible, but that's incorrect. Uh, Church of Wi-Fi. I ain't touching jet brains without a front pull. Sorry. All right. No, sorry. No, it's not it's jet. It's it's uh, Java. Fine. Yeah, it's All Java. All the jet brains are Java. Yeah. Sorry. Oh, it's terrible. Yeah. Um. Okay. Um. Well, we have reached uh, the end of uh, our second round. Double. Hacker Jeopardy. Uh, so real quick, uh, let's uh, tally up uh, our beers. Uh, so Mr. Sexual Doc, Mr. Doctor Sexual Potato MD, got two, two, two beers. Renderman. Uh, we'll call it four. I haven't finished the fifth. I haven't also right. been drinking for four. like a year, so. That's fair. Uh, Mog, we've got like two actual beers and two cans, okay? So we've got yeah, actually uh, three total, beers um, and one can. Because one's a peach. Three beer. beers. Three beers and one can of peach shit. <laughs> All right. I don't so have a nasty hangover 900... tomorrow. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Hey, at least we got and a sorry uh, out of it. I'll take it. Sorry. <laughs> We're Canadian. That's what yeah, they said. Here's a break. How many beers, Jeff? <laughs> Just one? Bueller? I think he's Bueller. saying wait until he talks. Nine! Nine! Nine. Nine. <laughs> oh my god. All right. I'm expecting to come here and death for the moment. Yeah. That does, it does explain the reduction in quality of, of, of responses towards the end of the show. That makes <laughs> sense. Uh, Sketch, how many do you have? Zero. <laughs> No beers. And then Logan, how many beers? Six. Oh my god. Six. Okay. You beat yep. the Canadians like at 15. the drinking competition. Start starting the new year off right. right or wrong oh, yeah. or right. Ooh. Right is the correct answer. All right. So, I'm impressed though. On behalf of Canadians everywhere, so I drank the Canadians at the annual drinking competition. We salute you. All right, 96. We accept this praise. 53. Bless you. Okay. Well, the, uh, the the scores as they sit on the screen are correct. Uh, Church of Wi-Fi, 9,600. Show and tell at 5,300. It is not a runaway game. It is not a runaway game. Uh, so here, if you've not seen this part of Hacker Jeopardy before, uh, at this point in time, uh, I will be showing the uh, final Hacker Jeopardy category to our teams. They will be nominating one person to play for every team who will set a wager and execute the final Jeopardy clue. So our final tie-breaking everything on the line category is... It's finally almost 2021. When will it all be over? <laughs> what if we love tie? It, love Category it, is love it. finally it. almost 2021. When will it all be over? Uh, so Mog will be it. playing. Define <laughs> no. it. Mog, who will be playing? I don't know. Dan, do you feel Jeopardy. like you got this? I'll give it a shot. Yeah. All right. All you're right. Ready. Dr. Dr. Potato, go ahead and get your writing utensils ready. Uh, and uh, if you want to go ahead and start locking in your wager of your 9,600 points. Uh, Jeff, who's going to be playing for show and tell now? Logan, will you volunteer as tribute? Or are you playing? No, I have a question. For... What yeah. happened if we tie? <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Although, Dan, for bet, what do you think? Sketch. I swear to God. Are you up for uh, this? I'll take it. God. I'll take one for All the right. team. I believe in you. <laughs> All You're right, wrong, Logan, but that that's you? fine. No, I'm doing Wait, it. Wait, no, so sketch. All right, sketch. All right, cool. All right, so Dave, uh, go ahead and shut down everybody's audio for me. Uh, remember, uh, go ahead and uh, when you have your wager written down, uh, Dr. Potato and Sketch, uh, go ahead and keep them in frame for me so uh, you know we can see that you've actually locked it in. All right, that's good. And good. Okay. 
Without any further ado, your well, you, you don't have to show it to me. Okay, why? What? It, it doesn't matter. Here we go. Here's your final category. You're gonna have uh, 60 seconds. Good luck. In hexadecimal, the number of full years remaining until the Unix epoch rolls over. You have 60 seconds. Good luck. Dave, open everybody up. Uh, we are going to start with show and tell net. Uh, a sketch, can you uh, show us and read out your response? Oh, I think, what is, what is F? What is F? I think we, we still need the audio on uh, there, Dave. Uh, but uh, no, I'm sorry. Uh, that is incorrect. How much did you wager? Fifty two hundred. Fifty two hundred. Fifty two hundred. So we're going to be reducing your score down to one hundred dollars. One hundred dollars. Uh, good try. Uh, Dr. Sexual Potato, what was your response? I'm very confident about this. Uh, my answer is uh, what is Telnet? <laughs> what is Telnet? It's a great guess, but I'm sorry that's incorrect. Uh, sexual Potato, how much did you wager? Uh, that is 900. Uh, 900, taking you down to 8,500. And before we start celebrating, did anybody on the on the on the clue have it? Mog, do you have it? Jeff, do you have this one? Anybody have it? Does anybody know what year it is when the epoch rolls over? I don't even know what year it is now. <laughs> That's 2037. Time has no meaning anymore. Yeah, no, it's Thursday. 2038. Before yeah, we reveal Thursday. the answer, can we get a shout out to Alex Trebek? Yeah, yeah. That's, uh, oh, no, you were yeah. Canadian. May he rest in peace. Yeah, no, uh, for, for everybody, uh, here at DFIU TV and Hacker Jeopardy, uh, I can tell you that, uh, Alex has been an inspiration to us all. Not only as uh, you know the format of the game that we love, but also as somebody who is an excellent human that like to take care of the humans around them. And uh, please try to be a little bit like Alex Trebek in your life. Uh, always keep going after knowledge and taking care of those around us, because uh, there's nothing more important than that. Uh, but uh, thank you all very, very much. With the power vested in me and the reconciliation of the abominations of 2020 uh, on this DEF CON New Year's Eve, I'm happy to announce that the Church of Wi-Fi, with a runaway victory, is the winners of 2020. Good job, fellas. Making Alex Trebek a saint of the Church of Wi-Fi. Wonderful. As very well he should be. Uh, well, uh, without any further ado, thank you all very much. Thanks a lot for our two teams. Let's give them a round of applause. Thanks a lot to the crew that put this on. Thanks to Wayne. Thanks to Dave. Thanks to Kaylee. Thanks to the scorekeeper, G Lane, everybody. Ooh, la la. Well, uh, everyone, Don't thanks a lot. Uh, DEF CON New Year's Eve. This has been Hacker Jeopardy pulling a wrap to 2020. And from my heart to yours, 
It's going to be 21, 2020, 2021 soon, everybody. For my you fucked years, it up. I, I did fuck <laughs> it up. But from now on, from now on, don't fuck it up. I'm Lintile. This is Hacker Jeopardy. Good night. Go!